Welcome back to another edition of Trial by Fire. Of course, today I'm going to be trying another sauce, and this one is another one from Royal Pepper. This is the Marquis. It's a mango habanero hot sauce. So, again, not expecting a whole lot of heat with this. Last uh, sauce I tried of theirs was the dill pickle sauce, which was really good on the dill pickle chips. <laughs> this one is another one that I picked up from the Heat Wave uh, Festival. Yeah, let's see what this one has in it. Besides being one half an hour, that is. Uh, ingredients. Mango pulp, peppers, vinegar, onions, water, lemon limes, spices, salt, citric acid, natural flavors, sugar, and xanthan gum. It's made here in Ontario. It's a mild sauce, so I'm not, as I said, not expecting a whole lot of heat with it, but it sounded good. Mango and habanero, always a good combination. I just have to get that thing open. While I'm doing this, I'd just like to thank everybody for watching the video, for checking out my channel, and first time here welcome if you're a repeat viewer thanks for coming back uh, hopefully you're enjoying the videos and you're checking out some of my other videos that I have yeah, get that off after itchy itchy <laughs> maybe it means I'm gonna win some money or something wait no, that's the hand I don't know what the HEA means, if it means anything. <laughs> so it's got a, a good run to it. It's a, a thinner sauce. Ooh. Nice little pop on that. I'm not sure if that was caught on camera or not. Oh, you, you can smell the habaneros. Mm, the flowery, the floral scent of a habanero. Mm. Yeah, it's a very, very loose sauce. So this should be a fun pour. Mm. Excuse me. As I was going to say, though, if you are watching these videos and you are enjoying them, please subscribe. Uh, I appreciate it. The algorithm helps me the videos out to more people. It brings up the subscriptions that eventually I'll be able to go live and do some great videos right in front of you guys and be more fun. <laughs> I know my ways to go for that, but hey, you can't hurt to try, right? Okay, so. Ooh, wow. Yeah. She definitely pours easily. Got a nice orange tinge to it. Kind of reminds me of like almost like a honey mustard color. Maybe a touch darker. Definitely doesn't smell like honey mustard. <laughs> mm. Smell habanero is just a smell I really like. Like I'm not even smelling the mango though. But find out if it tastes like mango. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any new videos coming out. Cheers. a little bit of a bite it's an odd combination though like to be honest I'm not even tasting <clears throat> the habaneros are the 
mangoes. It's just a weird kind of taste. At least for my palate, anyways. Not sure what I'm tasting. Yeah. It's an odd taste to me. I would give it another go, but <clears throat> onions being so high on there with my allergy, I do have to watch that. Because I'm not sure if that's kind of what I'm tasting. Not tasting, tasting onion, but I'm not tasting the others either, so. I don't know. It's a decent sauce, like, don't get me wrong. It's not one I would buy again, but it's a decent sauce. I was kind of hoping for a more mango-y taste. Um, it's very pepper-forward in the aroma. Not so much in the taste. The taste is... Yeah, it, it's hard to pin down exactly what the taste is on this. Because it's not mango -y, it's not habanero. I'm definitely not tasting the lemon or lime either, like the citrus in it. Not a whole lot of sp spice flavoring coming forward either. Yeah. I don't know. Heat. Maybe a one. One and a half. Um, Taste-wise, for me... Not a real winner, but the other sauces I have had of theirs were really good. So, just not for me on this one. But on that note, <clears throat> enjoy the heat, stay spicy. We'll see you next time, and don't forget to uh, do the usual stuff, as I said before. And, yeah, we'll keep you entertained in the future. <laughs> Take care. Yeah, I'm not sure on this one. The monkey.